Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Tina here. Uh, first off, I want to start by saying thank you guys for the continued support. Um, I really appreciate it. And hello to all my new subs. Hello to all my new subscribers. I know it's not many of you guys, but I do appreciate that my little channel is growing. Uh, it's not quite where I want it to be yet, but I'm still learning and I'm still growing and I'm still trying to figure out what I want my channel to be. So I'm kind of right now just going with the flow and just, you know, just doing what I like to watch on YouTube. Um, yeah, so as you can see by the title, today's video is going to be a haul from one of my favorite stores, Five Below, who does not love Five Below. And if you do not have Five Below in your city, you are missing out for real. Because I recently just discovered it a couple of months ago and I've been in love ever since, literally. So yeah, I'm going to be showing y'all some of the things I got from there. If you want to continue watching and see what I got, then go ahead. All right, excuse me if my eyelashes look a little droopy. Um, I don't know, these are new. I got them from the hair store. So just getting used to them but yeah first thing I got from five below um let's start with the fitness so the first thing I got was these pair of well they call them training shorts but you know basically like compression shorts it's the front they are super cute they have the little pocket where you can put your phone in you can put your phone in on both sides um, they fit good. I inserted a picture of them on. They're a size small. They're super cute. They had a um, they had these and they had some gray ones, but I like these better because anything pink is right up my alley. <laughs> the next thing I got were these leggings. Now these are super cute and they fit really good. Uh, they're like the gray and they have the little black at the bottom. The black is like I think they call this mesh. The black is mesh, so it's see-through. Super cute, and they're so comfortable. Like, they're really, really, really soft. They feel like a really good quality, and they feel like they won't be the ones that tear up in the washing machine. But yeah, I love these. These are super cute. I really like these. They also had these, uh, they had these same ones, but all the way gray at the bottom, and I think they, I don't know if they had any black ones, but I have a lot of black leggings. I don't need any more. I mean, I probably do need some more, but I like these great ones they super cute next thing I got were these sports bras um I'm a little bit on the bustier side so the sports bras for me it was just a little bit too much side boob spilling out and these are size large so um yeah it was a little bit too much side boob out so I think these I'll probably just wear under just like a t-shirt like this or something because I have like one of these type sports bra type thing because I wouldn't consider this a sports bra because first of all the material is not as compressed as a sports bra would be it seems like it wouldn't have any support but I um I got these because I thought they would good go, they would go good under my shirts because I have one like this on now because the padded bras for me it's just I'm sick of them they are no they're uncomfortable so I just would rather stick with the um just little tops like this to keep me together but keep me also comfortable too so I got it in gray and I also got it in black and like I said they're both a large because I am on the heavier side at the top I'm small at the bottom but on the top I'm a little bit heavy but um yeah the next thing I got and the thing I'm most excited about are these dumbbells. These are four pound weights. Um, they had five, they had five, they had two. I don't know if they had 10, but I thought the four pound weights would be just enough for me. Not too heavy, but not too light to where I don't feel like I'm doing anything. So they're a good, it's a good amount of weight on here for um, my arm exercises. Cause mostly I, I usually, mostly work out my legs and my butt and my stomach. I don't usually work out my arms that much, so I thought getting some weights would motivate me more to work out my upper body. So, next thing I got, that, which I felt like was a really cool purchase, was this water bottle humidifier. Bam. This uh, water bottle humidifier, so basically you just take a water bottle and you plug the little top on there and you plug it into the wall and it's literally blows out the like it blows out the air and that's so cool 
so you can even take the the water bottle and add you a few drops of essential oils in there and it'd be like a little diffuser because i'm like who thought of this who thought of taking a water bottle and putting a top on it so it can blow out air like that's crazy to me <laughs> so the next thing i got was this aroma diffuser just to have um on my little nightstand on the side of the bed um yeah this is just a cute little one i didn't open it up yet let me open it up and see how it looks comes with a little usb um charging port and this is it right here it's a little small little thing cute it's really feels really not sturdy um yeah Uh, yeah, it feels really not like, it feels like it's nothing inside of it. I don't think you're actually supposed to put water in here, but um, yeah. Aroma diffuser includes six light modes to help you set a peaceful ambience. I don't think mist comes out of here. I don't know, I'll, I'll plug it up and, and work on it and see what it does. The next things I got were these Freeman's clay masks, uh, one for me and one for my boyfriend. Um, this one is the Anti-Stress Dead Sea Minerals Clay Mask. It says instantly cleans pores and balances for renewed skin, all skin types. Yeah, so it's just a little blue mask. And I have the apple, uh, I have the apple cider vinegar one like this and I love that one. I could really see a difference and it really evens my skin tone and keeps texture down on my skin so I'm excited to try this one and I was really excited for this one because I didn't know that Freeman's made men's masks so this one is the total control whiskey rye clay mask for men it says beard friendly while combating blackheads oils and large pores so yeah I'm excited for him to try this one hopefully it helps with um some of his breakouts and even his evening his skin tone and reducing the bumps that um come when he gets edge ups so yeah, I'm really excited about that. Next, I got a facial brush and it comes with three other attachments besides the actual brush. Um, it's about time for me to get a new one. The one that I've had, I've had it for a long time and I know that's bad because you're not supposed to keep those face brushes that long, especially if you're not changing the, um, the little rotating head, whatever it's called, the brushes. If you're not changing the brushes, um, it's bad to keep using them because you're just collecting all that bacteria. But this facial brush, this facial brush comes with three different, three extra heads. So I thought that was cool. So, it's like this. I don't want to drop it. Got the brush right here. It's battery powered. I wonder, do I even have batteries for this? How many, how many batteries did it take? Oh, double A. Okay, yeah, I have double A batteries. That's all I thought I did have batteries in there. Don't you just hate when products don't have the batteries already in there? Like, that just hurts my nerves. But yeah, so it's really small and cute and pink. It has the pumice stone. Um, I don't think I'll be using this on my face. Uh, seems pretty harsh. It has a sponge. I'm curious to see how that works and it also has a little massager so that's kind of cool I guess when I apply my um my moisturizers I can go ahead and uh, massage it into my skin so I'm excited to try that so the next thing I got is actually what I'm using to record on right now and that is this foldable phone stand by Vibe it took me a while to set it up and get it sturdy because I don't want my phone to fall and break, but it's holding up pretty good. Uh, it's pink, I, that's why I gravitated towards it. Um, you just mount it right on a table and you just pull it up, fold. But I really wanted a phone stand because like I said, I have a DSLR and it's just not giving me the quality that I need. Like I've 
watched numerous YouTube videos. I've researched what settings can I use when I'm making my YouTube videos and make and give it that clear HD gravitate you to the video because it looks really nice look and it, I'm just not getting it from the camera so I don't know if it's because I need another one and that was pretty outdated but I decided this is kind of like my test video so I'm recording on my iPhone XR to see how the quality weighs up and see if I should just continue making my videos on my iPhone until I get a new camera or should I just keep on recording with my Canon T3i so yeah I just got this so I could record on and not have to worry about, you know, rigging up some type of stand. But what this is, it's pretty cool. I like it. The next thing I got was this Feeling Flawless Happy and Hydrated On The Go Facial Mist. It says hydrates and calms skin with cucumber and aloe. They had a couple of scents in this. I just got this one because when I was looking at the ingredients, I seen the like most of the ingredients on the, on here were stuff that I could pronounce and stuff that I was familiar with. Most of the other ones there, it just seemed like a bunch of, um, what's the word I'm looking for? A bunch of chemicals, I guess. Yeah. So yeah, this one seemed like it had the most natural ingredients and I already tried to spray it on and it smells really good and it did give my face like a boost of freshness and refreshness so let's see yeah <laughs> you could definitely smell the cucumbers in here yeah the cucumbers are strong okay second to last thing i got uh i'm really excited about this purchase too this one is a my happiness journal it says strong mind grateful heart and happy soul uh inside it has a little slot I guess where you can put like you know little notes or whatever you want to put in there um it says this year's resolution right here and then it has start each day with a positive thought um so basically it goes by every week it says this week you put your dates and it says for this week I love to blank I'm looking forward to blank I need to blank and fitness goals for the week and at the end of the week, you go back and you say, um, I'm grateful for this. I enjoyed this. I accomplished this. And it says, it has a bottom where it says silver linings and mindful moments of that week. So I really like this because um, I guess I'm feeling like, you know, in this quarantine, I feel like during this quarantine, I've been kind of on like a spiritual and more, you know, journey of finding myself in you know just kind of just kind of like trying to boost my inner confidence and trying to be like tap into what I know Latina the potential that I have inside and just trying to apply that because I feel like what what better time to really focus on the thing that you want to do and focus on your dreams in this time where we're not going to work and we don't nothing's open like I feel like this is the perfect time for us people who have been making excuses as to why we're not why we're not following our dreams to really get out there and start doing the work so i think this will be a great start for me uh I, if y'all would like me to document my journey of what i am uh putting in my journal and what steps i'm taking to follow my dreams and achieve my goals that i am setting then let me know and i will um you know i can go ahead and document that journey for you guys because um, I love to see other women who have documented their journeys and see how far they have become, you know, because it really motivates me to do what I want to do. And, you know, just really just deep, deep down in there and see what is my purpose on this earth? What has God put me for? Because we're all here for a reason. It's really, this is really the time for us to figure out what it is on this earth that we're destined to do. So, yeah, this is, this is the gym right here. And I'm really going to dedic dedicate myself to writing in this journal every week. So, yeah. Hopefully, I can do it. I feel like I can do it. Uh, I'm manifesting it right now. I'm going to be able to write in, write in this journal every week. I'm going to achieve my goals. And by the end of this year, I'll be have accomplished everything I said that I wanted to do. But, yeah. So, everything was really affordable. Everything was $5 and under. Hence the term five below. Um... So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and thank you guys for the continued support. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!